ammeter, an ammeter or ampere meter measures current flow in amperes. The term ammeter refers to a tool or apparatus used to measure current. This device's internal resistance is zero, but it actually has some internal resistance. This internal resistance value has a significant impact on this device's measuring range. An ammeter is a device that measures the current flow within a series circuit, which means it must have a very low impedance. The resistance and inductive reactance of these coils are extremely low. Because there must be less voltage loss across it, this gadget's operation has to be very low. The ammeter is typically linked to the circuit in series in order to measure the current. Typically, a little quantity of current in the milliampere or microampere range is measured using this apparatus. The term milliameter refers to a device that measures current in milliamperes, whereas the term microammeter refers to a device that measures extremely small electric currents calibrated in microamperes. The letter A stands in a circuit for the ammeter, common type of ammeter, 1. Analog ammeter, the resistance and inductive reactance of these coils are extremely low. Because there must be less voltage loss across it, this gadget's operation has to be very low. 2. Digital ammeter, Shunt resistors can be used to provide a calibrated voltage that is proportionate to the flow of current. This kind of instrument measures current flow in amperes and shows the results on a digital display. To help the user troubleshoot fluctuating loads and trends, these instruments provide information on the present draw and continuity. Classification, a moving coil, it works by taking advantage of magnetic deflection, which causes a coil to move inside the magnetic field as current flows through it. This device's coil is free to move back and forth between the poles of permanent magnets, B G L E C T R D U N M I C. this kind of ammeter has a moving coil that rotates through a fixed coil in the generated field. When compared to moving coils and permanent magnet moving coils, this device has exceptional accuracy. This instrument's primary purpose is to accurately measure AC and DC with a tolerance of 0.1 to 0.25%. C. Moving iron, alternating currents, and voltages can be calculated with this kind of ammeter. The movable mechanism of this gadget incorporates specially designed soft iron components that move in response to the electromagnetic force exerted by a coil of wire. D. Hot wire. A hot wire is one that is used to measure AC or DC by passing it through a wire to cause the wire to heat up and expand. By passing heat from the current supply via the wire, this gadget increases the wire's diameter. This is applied to AC and DC, E, digital, shunt resistors can be used to provide a calibrated voltage that is proportionate to the flow of current. This kind of instrument measures current flow in amperes and shows the results on a digital display. F. Integrating. The product of time and current is obtained in this device by adding the current flow over time. These tools determine the total amount of energy provided through the circuit in a certain amount of time. The watt-hour meter, which measures energy directly in watt-hours, is the best illustration of this integrating device. Let US move now in ammeter reading, note that you have TO connect the probes in a series method. Given the illustration wherein a circuit consists of a switch and a source connected through wires in series. The test probes must be set in series mode in order TO check the value in amperage. Next IS you have to know the range to get the value of each line. For an example, the pointer is in between the range of 0 and 1. So therefore the value in ampere is equivalent to 0.5 amperes. Example number 2, the pointer points in between the range 2 and 3, and the value is equal to 2.2 ampere. And lastly, in example number 3, the pointer points the range 3. So the answer is 3 amperes.